in a town where the traffic is unpredictable. A young antelope wandered out onto the road and was hit. And there he lay on the side of the road, dead for a while. But luckily, the SUV that hit him was a radioactive SUV. And so he came back to life and became the greatest hero the world has ever known. For weeks on end, he wandered the woods alone. He did all sorts of things, like charging through the trees, eating grass. and wishing that he had mighty majestic antlers like these. But instead, he has these antlers. He spent a great deal of time charging through the dizzying, almost vomit-inducing forest of Norris, charging into things head first. He found that he wasn't the only one affected by the radioactive SUV. This cantaloupe became Cantaloupe Man. From his perch on Mrs. Budson's table, he plots Antelope Man's downfall. Now, Antelope Man charges through suburbia, preparing for a battle with Cantaloupe Man. What was that? Every day, he gets hit by another radioactive vehicle, and every night, he comes back to life. Will he be ready for the final showdown? I will destroy you, Antelope Man. What do you have to say to that? Hey, kids! Do you know what sound an antelope makes? Let's find out! Uh. Only time will tell. Antelope Man. Antelope Man. Antelope Man. Antelope Man.